Банде Гуру Падат Дандам Бхакта Бинда Саманитан Си Чайтанна Прабхум Банде Нитананда Саходитам Си Нанда Нанда Нанг Банде Радика Чарано Дайям Гопи Жану Самаюктам Бинда Ванаману Харам Ванша Калпатару Ваша Кипа Синду Бевача Патитанам Павуне Бавишну Бибью Наму Нама Мукан Кару Дивача Алан Панглан Хайте Гирим Ят Кипа Тамаханга Банди Парама Нандамадаван Бендави Тусиде Байпиявай Кешева Сача Шнавакти Паде Деви Шаттабатвай Наму Нама Нарайона Намаскитто Наранча Ивана Раттама Девин Сарасватин Вясам Татуджа Йомудире Шанкита Никишна Катопадиси Гаурия Патрашо Бракаса Нича Шадану Рапта Гуру Бхакти Юкто, Бхакти Прамодакша Джагод Барунну, Дейям Сада Парибабагна Абишта Духам, Итас Падам Сива Виринчину Там Сараньо, Витакти Хам Панатабал Дабхабад Дипутам, Панде Махапуру Шате Чаруна Рабиндам. Ядпада паллаба на качанда маничатай. Бисфурджи, так ми пига по воду, что дарши. Пурна, рагра, сусагра, сара, мути. Сара, зика, маникада, кипан, карси. Си, кишна, чайтана, прагунита, нанда. Си, дайте года, дарсива, садихи, гаура, фуртабин. Сри Кришна Чайтанна Прабхунита Ананда Сри Аддейта Гада Дхара Сива Сади Гаура Бхакта Бинда Хари Кришна Хари Кришна 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 Хари 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 Рам Хари Рам Рама, Рама, Хари, Хари. Аджану ламбита хуяу канака бодато, санкертаной кабитаро камала ятакшо, вишам бару дижо бару югадар мапалу, банде ягат прия кару, каруна утаро. Хари Кришна, Хари Кришна, Кришна Кришна, Хари Хари, Хари Рам, Хари Рам, Рам Рам, Хари Хари. Аджан ламмита бхужау канака бодато, Санкертаной кабитару камала хитакшу. Гишам бару дижа бару югадхарма пару. Банде джагат прия кару, каруна бхатару. Хари Кришна, Хари Кришна, 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 Хари Хари. Хари Рам, Хари Рам, Рам Рам, Хари Хари. Намами Ганге Табападу Дупанкаджам, Сура Сурайра Бандито Дипарупам, Буктин Чамуктин Чадада Синитам. Баван Рубе Насада Наранам 
गंगातरंगरमणीयटाकलापम गौरी निरंतर विभूषितबाभाग नारायण प्रिय मनोमदापहारम वाराणसीपुरपति भजवीशनाथ वागीशजुष वदने लक्ष्मीज सक्षसी जस्ते हृदय संबीतम भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे प्रेमांजन छुरीत भक्ति विलोचन न सत सदैव हृदय विलोकयती जम श्याम सुंदरम चिंत गुण सर्वम गोविंदमादिपुरुषम तम हम भजा प्रेमांजन छुरीत भक्ति विलोचन न सत सदैव हृदय विलोकयती जम श्याम सुंदरम चिंत गुण सर्वम गोविंदमादिपुरुषम तम हम भजा गौरी गोष्ठीपति गौरी गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमश जगत गुरु टोल्ड दैट सेवा दैट वर्ड इज देयर फॉर इट इज नॉट एट ऑल एप्लीकेबल फॉर ईच एंड एवरी प्लेस यू कांट यूज दैट वर्ड सेवा इन ईच एंड एवरी प्लेस दिस वर्ड सेवा इट कैन नॉट बी एप्लीकेबल इन ईच एंड एवरी प्लेस it is not at all good to use this word each and everywhere but but all the material people they actually want to use the seva of that the narayan is also becoming daridra he is becoming very uh, poor they are so much foolish they are thinking that narayan is actually poor that to do daridra narayan seva to do to go horse seva to do uh, of, uh, that chagal seva and to do water seva this word they are actually using there this is actually seva for them but this actually word seva is not at all applicable everywhere why because seva means kuch karna that to do something kuch karna to do something that is called seva that is that is called seva just to do uh, do nice thing that is called seva in that iska you will you are actually getting the topmost benefit where he is getting the topmost anand that you should do in Jee which you will get the topmost anand seva. that is actually called seva Matlab, it means that he is getting some benefit some happiness is getting out of that but this word this actually used in this material world then this uh, this is not at all good at all this word this word seva it is only applicable for vaikuntha vastu you can just uh, it is applicable for the vaikuntha vastu it is only applicable for those uh, objects related to vaikuntha there is to do horse seva dog seva cat seva this is not at all applicable this word this is this is not that but still it is material seva seva is only applicable for vaikuntha vastu and for not applicable for other material like dham seva naam seva vishnu seva bhagavad in bhagavad ji mahapuran seva so this is the top most of all you can do and the other kind of seva that word is no why do you are not at all this word seva is used applicable for others because you will be just misusing that uh, that seva was to seva you just need to do that if you will be doing the material object seva then he'll just getting into the bonded material <coughs> if i'll be giving some nice uh, chapati to uh, the dog then it is called uh, that i am giving some nice chapati to the dog and if i am giving uh, something to crow or pigeons but if this vichar that uh, the, uh, the actual uh, vichar is to just uh, uh, give food to the crow then definitely he will also get into the material bondage if ranti dev maharaj 
like that which are we are having that i am actually doing seva of parmatma that each and every person bhagwan is there inside the heart of everyone so whatever seva i am doing of each and every jeeva i will be doing the seva of bhagwan himself and bhagwan also has just accepted the same point in front of uddhav ji maharaj that uddhav that if some person and is giving some very uh, some uh, pain to others if some if one jiva is actually giving pain to other jiva then he is definitely giving pain to me only he is definitely indirectly giving pain to me because in each and every one i am sitting inside the heart as parmatma ronti dev ji in in the life of ronti dev whatever seva he has done in his life that he has just made a full vichar in his life after that he is doing that kind of seva ki that for each and every seva whatever i am doing it is actually the seva of bhagwan only this kind of bhav is there the actual vichar is there in the shastra regarding this there are lot of vichar regarding this in the shastras as well that you see that now the actual meaning is coming out is that that in the vaikunth jagat if you are actually doing the vast, actual vaikunth vastu seva then in that seva what is the actual result is that that i should get relief from this material bondage that should be the topmost result that just to get out of the material bondage is very simple thing ordinary thing but the other things that in order to you can get the actual seva of the vaikunth jagat also that's why sadhya sadhan tat that krishna bhakti the actual actual mool of uh, the, the actual uh, mool of the krishna bhakti sadhu sang so the, all the shastras are there regarding that which is proving that so just by whatever that which object particular object you will be serving according to that inside that all qualities will come if you will be doing the seva of a prostitute then definitely you will be thinking like a prostitute and if you if you will not are if you are not at all believing me i can just practically show you this point in front of you if you can come in front of me whatever seva you will do according to that that uh, um, uh, heart you will get according to that and your uh, so if you will be serving guru vaishnav your heart will become like that so that is the actual rules that what is the actual dharma of the sevya vastu just be careful on this point what i am speaking that that what is the actual dharma of the sevya vastu that it should definitely get inculcated into the sevak of this there is no doubt the actual dharma of the sevak vastu definitely it will get inculcated in the sevak as well even if you will be doing the will be coming the seva of cats and dogs definitely you will become cat and dogs in the less uh, next life as well so whatever this no so whatever thinking you are doing and you will be just leaving your body according to that consciousness the same thing you will you are getting uh, your whole heart and mind onto the lotus feet of onto the onto dog only then only definitely you will become a dog in the next life also uh, before i just it's like 40 years back i was actually just sitting in one office and in dalhousie square i was sitting there at that point one one madwari person one gujarati sorry he was actually just reading one newspaper and he actually i just went there see babu what is written what actually is written there he is seeing speaking that one very nice rich person one very nice rich person from england then one very nice rich person from england he actually he has given all his property millions and million pounds he has he has just uh, uh, given all the millions and millions pounds he don't have any kind of child no friend nothing he has what he has done he has just uh, given all his property and whatever he has money he has just given it on the name of a dog you see such a very nice and strange uh, story it is that that the, our one master ji one teacher of school one one time he is actually just uh, telling me that you beta you see news that this news the word actual news you know what do you mean by news news the news actually okay that is actually the news okay but information regarding something but that news that what is newspaper is there no that north east west south these four directions okay 
सो यू सी इफ यू कैन मेक एन एक्चुअल विच आर नॉर्थ ईस्ट वेस्ट साउथ दैट ऑल द फोर डायरेक्शन यू आर टेकिंग इन टोटो देन दैट इज कॉल्ड न्यूज एन यू डब्ल्यू एस नॉर्थ ईस्ट वेस्ट साउथ सो आई वॉज बिकमिंग वेरी मच हैप्पी ओ यस डेफिनेटली आई हैवेंट एक्चुअली जस्ट मेड दिस काइंड ऑफ गेस ही स्पीकिंग एक्चुअलीटली टॉप एब्सोल्युटली करेक्ट एन यू एन ई डब्ल्यू एस इज नॉर्थ साउथ ईस्ट वेस्ट सो दैट इज न्यूज सो ओके एंड इन न्यूज पेपर वॉट यू आर एक्चुअली गेटिंग द न्यूज एक्चुअली यूल बी गेटिंग द न्यूज पेपर इट विल बी रिगार्डिंग सम स्पेशल न्यूज विल डेफिनेटली बी कमिंग इन दैट बेटा यू सी दैट इवन द डॉग ही इज एक्चुअली जस्ट कटिंग वन डॉग इफ वन डॉग कटिंग वन मैन दैट विल इट विल नॉट कम इन द न्यूज पेपर नो इट विल नॉट कम दैट इज जस्ट एन ऑर्डनरी थिंग नेचुरली द डॉग विल डेफिनेटली कट द मैन बट इट विल नॉट कम इन द न्यूज पेपर when the dog will cut uh, the man it will not just get uh, installed installed in the newspaper but when the person will the man will cut the dog definitely it will just get published in the newspaper uh, i was just laughing at that point what he is speaking it's actually absolutely correct what he is speaking so in the name of dog all the all the millions of pounds actually has gone but all the our wife children everyone is actually giving uh, their property on our name but if that millions of pounds that kind of property has given to a dog it has already gone in, uh, in, in published in the newspaper and i was just laughing at that point and i was speaking to him that said ji oh prabhu this that person who actually has given so much property on the name of that dog that millions of pounds that he has just given on the property he has given on his uh, dog that it means that such a big dog he was and he was just laughing at me he has just given so much property on the name of dog so big dog he was that he has given so much property on the name of that dog because he don't know any application regarding that that maharaj in school college in educational institution whatever is there lot of things he got he has just given in on to the name of dog such a big dog he is that he has given that so the actual which are is like that so this seva this actual this word that uh, it is actually bhagwan dham naam parikar vishisht whatever seva you are doing regarding that but you have to do it in a very proper planning proper way that is from inside the heart you have to do that is called uh, um, bhajan definitely you will get that uh, vaikunth pathway you will get that uh, actual uh, vaikunth pathway you can get that actual vaikunth pathway then it is naturally uh, possible to get that but the bonded jeevas in the bonded condition if they will be doing the uh, the bonded object they will be serving that like wife children dog cat then definitely that no father in this whole world can just protect you from this material bondage so definitely you just need to be careful and have to do that so on the basis of this which are only on the basis of this which are only prabhupada actually speaking that seva that this body that this material body and mind this is not the actual work of our uh, uh, word prabhupada actually speaking you just be careful what i am speaking that prabhupada speaking that uh, what is the actual meaning of seva seva is actually to do vaikunth seva the prabhupada already told that point previously but prabhupada actually speaking now that seva this word is there this uh, word seva that the actual word is there this actually not at all related with material body and mind it is not at all related with that this our material body and mind it is not at all related with that this word seva this is the actual dharma phatma so actually in depth uh, which are prabhupada actually speaking in front of us seva is a atma dharm really so yes what is the who, to whom we should serve only bhagwan is there we who can serve who can get served by us only the bhagwan is the actual object of seva by this material body and mind and we cannot serve that uh, bhagwan on to that vaikunt platform but it cannot be done. but in bond and condition we can try to we can practice to uh, serve bhagwan that is called that is called what it what it it is called it is called sadhana kriya that is not at all sadhan this is not at all sadhan bhakti what we are performing this is not at all sadhan bhakti at all this is actually this is not at all sadhan bhakti this is not at all sadhan bhakti you can't speak that this is sadhan this is actually sad limb of sadhan this is sadhan kriya but under when we will be doing anugatya slowly steadily he will be just getting up 
to the higher platform and when he will be just getting on to a very stable platform and he'll be just following the actual uh, uh, instructions of the go of his gurudev then definitely his sadhan bhakti will get uh, started and if his sadhan bhakti gets started if his sadhan bhakti gets started of that particular sadhak then what to speak about other things and if some no aparad is done then definitely in the uh, coming uh, uh, time the lot of sadhan bhakti can give lot of things to him and there is lot of uh, things regarding this i will be discussing it tato adushatya tato sadhu sangam atho anatha nivritti sat nishtha ruchi tata itadi so there is a lot of uh, things adho sat that sadhu sang is of two folds and i have speak on this a lot of time at the time of upadesh amrit uh, discussion also i was discussing and if the person is actually making some mistake in that then it is a big problem atho bhajana kriya tato anatha nivritti sha tale pehle but the first thing is that adho that some shraddha should be there shraddha means that uh, just by doing krishna bhajan everything is done automatically that to have confidence on guru vishnu all the time so if uh, adho shraddha the first point is that shraddha should be there and then after that sadhu sang it is actually divided into two categories in two parts it is just categorized in two parts sadhu sang it is already categorized in the one sadhu sang is preliminary sadhu sang before taking diksha that kind of sadhu sang is very important and after taking diksha that kind of sadhu sang you want that means that just to do the actual association of guru work in both the both the association that sadhu sang what we are actually speaking that adho shraddha and sadhu sang in that in between that it is already understood in between that it is already understood that preliminary sadhu sang after doing that that actual sadhu sang if you are getting that means that you have just taken guru charanashray under the guidance of pure guru vaishnav you are just serving pure guru vaishnav it is already understood in this and after that if that adho shraddha is already and after that bhajan kriya and slowly steadily under the guidance of pure sadhu sang that bhajan kriya just by doing that bhajan kriya when it is actually started when actually it is just bhajan kriya is just getting transformed into trans sadhan bhakti then automatically there will be his whole his anarth nivritti will be there just by doing bhajan kriya slowly steadily what will happen he his bhajan kriya will transform into sadhan kriya sadhan bhakti will get started and it is after that anarth will definitely get removed and after when the anarth is removed then that sector everything will go on and at the last he will get prema so that is the actual process what i have told so this seva is the actual dharma of atma this is this actually our body which is actually full of uh, bad smell and this material body made of sack of blood and flesh this is actually just uh, full of bad smell and uh, sack of blood and flesh just why we can how we can just do seva just made of stool and urine this is a sack of stool and you know how we can just serve bhagwan with that how we can just serve that vacant object bhagwan it is not at all possible to serve bhagwan with this sack of blood stool and urine so that's why prabhupad speaking that seva of your atma this is the actual property the natural inclination of your atma that is called seva bhakti is the natural function of your soul bhakti means to do seva and seva is the natural function of our soul it is just not uh, related with our material body and mind this is not the actual dharma of material mind and our material and intelligence this is the actual dharma of our atma that in seva there is no kind of business mood or vaishya vritti if you are just making 4 rupees and you are getting 400 in that it's not like that but other others can do this kind of vaishya vritti or business vritti that in the name of preaching they are doing like that this kind of business vritti they are actually applying in that uh, in preaching so whatever be the case prabhupada actually speaking that in seva vritti that business uh, mood is not at all applicable because krishna sudhanu and sandhan seva that is actually called seva 
दैट सेवे वस्तु द टॉप मोस्ट सुख सुख अनुसंधान जस्ट टू गेट द एक्चुअल हैप्पीनेस सेटिस्फेक्शन ऑफ कृष्णा दैट इज एक्चुअली सेवा प्रीवियसली आई हैव ऑलरेडी टोल्ड इन द नाइट टाइम इफ माय ऑल माय व्हाट एवर आई एम डूइंग इफ इट एक्चुअली गिविंग सेटिस्फेक्शन टू भगवान दैट इज एक्चुअली सेवा and previously in the bangla katha only i was actually speaking this point if i'll be just speaking foul words to krishna and is krishna is becoming satisfaction that is beard will become seva for me like baldav ji maharaj has done baldav ji maharaj ji baldav ji maharaj balram ji maharaj at the lotus feet of balram ji now krishna used to just uh, uh, touch it with his hands and just used to massage the lotus feet of uh, balram ji maharaj krishna is uh, krishna bhagwan always used to do because the leela is net he always used to bhagwan shri krishna always used to <coughs> always used to take the lotus feet and always used to massage the lotus feet of balram ji what is actually getting the seva balram ji maharaj seva will be done no it's the actual krishna seva how However, it is which is reverse. It is not at all reverse. It is actually the actual pathway. Balram Ji Maharaj. The message approve the message of Krishna. Balram Ji Maharaj. He is actually can get to satisfy. Balram Ji Krishna can satisfy. That's why he is actually messaging the leg. You can understand what I am speaking. Balram Ji Maharaj can uh, get uh, satisfied. Balram Balram Ji Maharaj actually is thinking that Krishna will be messaging my leg. Then if Krishna is actually getting happiness in that satisfaction, and then it will become seva for me. So, so Bhagwan Sri Krishna is actually messaging the leg of Balram Ji Maharaj. And according to if you are have Krishna's vichar that he is actually serving his big brother. Balram Ji Maharaj, this is also good, also the correct way. But Krishna is actually serving Baldav Ji Maharaj because Krishna is actually messaging the leg of Baldav Ji Maharaj, and Baldav Ji Maharaj is also getting satisfied. That is also good. But Baldav Ji Maharaj cannot take any kind of seva from Krishna. Why? Because Baldav Ji Maharaj and Krishna, there is there is only one difference between them. What is that? Baldav Ji Maharaj and Krishna. That is the sevak tattva. He is he can act as a sevya tattva as well. Baldav Ji Maharaj actually is a sevak tattva. He can he is actually a sevya tattva. This is a miracle. This is very surprising to see. Baldav Ji Maharaj is actually sevak tattva. Just by having sevak tattva inside him, that kind of sevya tattva is also there. So just leave this point now. That sevak tattva in Chaitanya Bhagavat in Chaitanya Tamrit each and everywhere. बल्लाव जी महाराज इज ऑल द टाइम एक्चुअली वॉन्ट टू बिकम द सर्वेंट ऑफ कृष्णा सो वॉट इज द एक्चुअल रोल ऑफ द सर्वेंट जस्ट टू सर्व द लोटस फीट ऑफ द ऑफ द सर्वेंट इट हैव यू हैव यू एवर हर्ड Baldav ji maharaj actually servant of krishna in chaitanya bhagavat you can see in chaitanya ji tamrit also each and everywhere it is written that baldav ji maharaj is a servant of krishna so how actually master can just uh, 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 touch the lotus feet of servant it is not at all possible that's why i am speaking that baldav ji maharaj he is actually sevak tattva he can act as a sevya tattva okay it is it is like that that's why भगवान श्री कृष्ण दिस काइंड ऑफ राइट ऑन टू ऑन टू द लोटस फीट ऑफ बलदाव जी महाराज इज मैसेजिंग हिज लेग बिकॉज ही इज अ बिग ब्रदर बट बलदाव जी महाराज हैज दिस काइंड ऑफ फॉल्स ऑफ ईगो दिस ट्रांसडेंटल ईगो दैट आई एम द एक्चुअल सर्वेंट ऑफ कृष्णा that i am servant of krishna this kind of transcendental ego is there in baldav ji maharaj and if the servant if the master is actually just uh, uh, serving the lotus feet of uh, servant it can be done no it cannot be done but yes it can be done when actually krishna is actually messaging the leg of baldav ji maharaj and krishna bhagwan is actually getting satisfied then it is okay he is getting the top most anand in that bhagwan shri krishna actually just uh, messaging the leg of balram ji is actually is getting the seva automatically getting satisfied so balram actually is uh, lotus feet is served by krishna but balram ji also getting the same seva but uh, krishna is getting the satisfaction so this uh, seva sevak sambandh you can understand from here prahlad maharaj ji also speaking that thakur ji that i don't have any kind of uh, greedy attitude towards you 
and i don't have any kind of relationship of uh, uh, very bad smelling greediness i don't have i am actually don't want to just make a very dirty relationship with you i just want to make a very uh, you are my sevya vastu and i am your sevak i am your servant i am your servant and i want to just do your seva and why you are actually speaking that you just give me something give me some give me i don't want anything prabhu from you at all i don't need anything from you just i need this thing that i need the lotus feet that's where that's it oh you are taking you want to take something yes i want to take the lotus feet that's it in order to just make your honor in your honor i am actually going to ask something from you prabhu okay you are actually i don't need anything from you prabhu i don't need anything from you why because you are my actually nirupadik without any uh, without any title you are my master and i am your uh, without title i am your servant that i don't have any kind of desire that i want to be your servant automatically i am your servant but still okay if you are asking me and you are all that repeatedly you are speaking that you should ask me okay i am asking you what what i am asking pralad maharaj speaking to narsingh dev that thakur ji that i am asking you that that inside my heart whatever kind of desire and asakti is there that should not at all come that kind of material lust material desire should not come inside my heart this actually i am asking you that prabhu inside my heart all the time no kind of material desire should get installed inside that it should not get it should not grow so actually parlan maharaj is so much uh, sir uh, parlan maharaj is so much clever you see servant is so much clever so this kind of business would be not at all applicable in seva why because why i am actually making this background why i am actually is making the background why i am actually discussing all this concept in front of i am discussing it so that in this rag batam chandrika so that i can discuss at the actual in depth which are you can understand easily in the uriya there is one kind of word that gurudev i always used to smile and speak in uriya gurudev always used to smile and speak that in uriya idia lang in uriya language raga uchi means then rag odia means uh, ra- rag means that it's very much uh, uh, sharp like like uh, mirch you can see green chili it is actually rag in odia we are speaking raga uchi and in bengali rag means that is becoming angry in hindi also we are actually speaking gussa gussa means to become angry and this rag batarma chandrika when while before discussing it i in order to just make a background in front of you by the kripa of krishna and by the uh, by the kripa of krishna so that you can understand this point first the actual in depth vichar of rag batarma chandrika what is the actual internal vishay of rag batarma and that is actually seva only that by what you will be doing by giving rag just to, to sir bhagwan in rag mark that's that is actually rag just that is vishnu chakravarti is showing us the actual pathway so what is the um, wrong thing in that so that's why in order to discuss it is very much important to have that open discussion regarding this so this seva this uh, word that this word seva lot of times in upadesh amrit uh, at the time of discussing upadesh amrit the first thing is that it should, he should be ahetuki and gurudev will be just uh, give, go going to the foreign country then only i'll serve gurudev it is just like a cat and dog which are this kind of which are, are even cats and dogs are actually more prominent than us they are more f- further prominent than us in the, in our which are they are actually more prominent than us at least cats and dogs are not at all speaking this no but we are speaking this point that gurudev will be uh, uh, send us to foreign then only i will serve gurudev i am not at all speaking lie to you i am not at all joking at you i'll i will not be speaking in uh, on the in the internet i'll be practically showing you that some person from england 
that he is actually giving sannyas to one uh, person and gurudev actually just becomes that way he is actually sahaj ya how i have given him sannyas and uh, after getting sannyas from gurudev there is actually he is giving indication that in england person is giving that you should be i should become the acharya this kind of uh, this kind of incident already happened in navadvip also he is giving good indication to gurudev that why you should be you should uh, gurudev you should uh, make me acharya gurudev thinking that how i can make him acharya then definitely if i make him acharya then uh, what to do <laughs> he is actually in a big trouble and uh, after that it's it's already happened that uh, at the last time of gurudev in the new in the paper they have already signed from the gurudev that that acharya has done that so a lot of incidents have not one incident lot of incidents have happened like that up till some time gurudev has just seen who, on what paper i have to sign just let me just let me see that gurudev is actually all the time deep in bhajan and he is actually taking all the sign from the paper what to do just all the actually material things what to do okay you want to become acharya go become acharya all foolish number 1 just become acharya no worries you can become just just take everything just take the asan of gurudev foolish number 1 just like is a, is a son of a cattle foolish number 1 just is they are making some sign on the paper of gurudev and it just would become acharya and the incident what i am actually speaking this is a actual incident i am not at all speaking any lie in front of you are you just in come in front of me i'll just going to show you each and everything that what he has done that gurudev has not make him uh, made uh, made him acharya some uh, old things were there and some uh, incident was there so that i will be definitely make you guru and that topmost guru you will become you will become a great preacher a great acharya in this uh, in material world that previously some setting was there so gurudev hasn't made him acharya and uh, he has made uh, other person acharya and in this angry mood that uh, he just kicked each and every sanyas out and he has just uh, got uh, some wife and children and he has just get into this uh, married life this is a fact i am speaking the absolute truth in front of you so if some this kind of desire is there inside your heart then uh, he what he will do by hearing rag rag batam chandrika he can just do business mood that's it as please he will not be doing any kind of fault and dosha will not uh, will uh, hit him but that va rag rag varma chandrika who will be hearing that who has the topmost uh, uh, that who is actually hearing this that he is the actual son of his father why he will be just hearing if he is not a son of his father definitely he want to hear that that with actual mood if he will be hearing that and with he just need to save his uh, life from that and the kind of uh, attitude that grief of sahajya that the from the hands of sahajya he just needs to save himself from the hands of sahajya 100% so so seva this word that kind of our own uh, happiness if we are thinking that in what is chetan in chetan chitam that is already written so in this that our own happiness there is not even a smell of that that our own happiness we should not seek at all that is called actually that is the actual definition of shuddha bhakti that person who is uh, up till now that person who is up till now is doing he don't know the definition of shuddha bhakti up till now and he is actually he doesn't doesn't understand this definition that what he will do by doing the shuddha bhakti what he will do by hearing all this uh, ragvatam chandrika what he can do in that he can't do anything what he will do you just let me know what he can do in that by just hearing ragvatam chandrika no use of hearing firstly what is the actual thing he just need to understand what is actually bhakti and after that he just need to put in into rules and regulation strict rules and regulation under guidance of pure guru vaishnav like gaur kishor das baba ji maharaj have already told us that in two words he has just told that maharaj how to do bhakti just let us know how we can get the lotus feet of bhagwan you beta you do one thing 
that early in the morning when you're getting up when you're getting up early in the morning with the chappal you just uh, uh, smash your face with the chappal in the early morning just that so much uh, that our heart is so much dirty that you should just put chappal on your face all in the morning time you are actually a cheater you are actually number one cheater you are the number of fraudster what to do what you can do so that's why prabhupada always used to speak prabhupada actually speaking here this is actually cheating propensity वैष्णव के इट्स ऑल रिटर्न बाय प्रभुपाद नो बडी एक्चुअली वॉन्ट टू हेयर दैट नो बडी इज देयर हू विल हेयर दिस काइंड ऑफ कमेंट्री बिकॉज दे डोंट नीड भगवान नो नो बडी नीड्स भगवान एट ऑल बट दे वॉन्ट फ्रॉम भगवान दे डोंट नीड भगवान नो बडी वॉन्ट्स भगवान जस्ट कम इन फ्रंट ऑफ मी जस्ट बाई जस्ट टचिंग द लोटस वीट ऑफ नरसिंग दे आर स्पीकिंग दैट दे आर नीड भगवान if you have this kind of uh, uh, if you have this kind of courage or your father has this kind of courage to speak that you need bhagwan you don't need bhagwan you what you will get what is the utility of bhagwan you don't need bhagwan they have understood that they, they have taken guru charan ashray these people they have all cheater frauds sir their guru dev and what the present guru dev is just just show me what kind of anugatha you have done just go to the court and just let me know that have you done the actual anugatha of your guru dev just give me the actual proof you have done the anugatha of guru dev no not at all he is actually number 1 fraudster every everywhere it's uh, all uh, uh, rubbish he is actually garbage he is actually spreading what to do so so like this everything is like this only what to do that uh, all actually are busy in getting the actual uh, samman or actual respect of a sadhu you don't want nobody wants to become a sadhu nobody wants to become a sadhu they don't have any kind of desire for that what to do by be- becoming a sadhu they just want to take the external wish of a sadhu and whatever they want to take they just want to take what they will uh, do by so sadhu is to be- to sacrifice devotional life means sacrifice i have already told it a lot of time this point that devotion is not but at present but at present we are actually guided by emotion devotion is not emotion devotion is not at all emotion with the help of emotion you can get demotion by the help of emotion you can get demotion and by devotion you can get promotion aya but it's already written this this point you can understand now that devotion is not emotion but our whole society guided by cheap emotional factors oh all old people have just just give him a nice seat there so he should be given the actual uh, uh, chairship of sabapati he just a foolish person is on the uh, on the chair on the chairship of uh, sab sabapati like in a material world you are say that the old man has come just i will be just sitting down and he will be sitting up <laughs> what to speak now you see all all the grandfather father grand grandfathers everything everyone actually is just sitting down on the floor and they are actually welcoming welcoming sukhdev goswami path by standing up and just sitting down uh, in front of sukhdev goswami path parashar everyone all big big naraji everyone actually is just with full well, welcoming mood is they are welcoming sukhdev goswami path it's not like that it's just a 16 year old boy you just need to throw him it's this kind of politics they are not at all doing why because that is that definitely he will be getting the vyasasan because he is eligible to get the vyasasan you can understand what i am speaking so so i have told a lot of time this point that emotion is not devotion emotion can lead to up to demotion 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 you will get demotion by that and devotion can help you to get promotion guru dev always used to speak this point what i am speaking in front of you but every vichar is gone into water 
all which are has just gone into water the kind of thing which are which is there is all actually gone in water what bhakti vinod thakur has spoken again and again that where actually there is no vichar that where everything definitely gonna go into water everything will get destroyed completely it is already destroyed bhakti vinod thakur already speaking this point that where there is no kind of uh, word called vichar there everything will uh, gonna destroy definitely everything will gonna get destroyed so this is the actual condition what to do that all actually in fighting and all want to cut and throw each and every one pranami pratishta name fame position everything is going on oh just need to destroy this maharaj just need to get away from this maharaj so this by this we will not be getting position no so that's why we just need to remove that maharaj so this is the con- actual condition now what to do this rag batar machandrika in order to just hear they are actually just want to hear that they are so much uh, thirsty to uh, we just need to configure that up till what level we have to uh, go we have to rise we have not understood that uh, that up till what level we have to go in our bhajan field in order to hear this ragvatam chandrika the shlok which i have already started with yatu bhakti ragaksha ji ahitu ke apratihata jayatma su prasid bhagwan atma bhagwan actually is atma parmatma and uh, in order to get uh, the actual satisfaction of atma we can get the topmost anand for atma that is called seva seva in that there is no kind of greediness there is no kind of interest left in that in seva in the vedanta the b the actual word b of vedanta just by writing the vedant you need b no te e danta so v we even the word v is also not is that of vedant the guru seva vaishnav seva apart from that leaving that the word v of vedant also you can't understand without guru vishnu seva you can understand what i'm speaking the vedant both you can't get the actual realization of vedant just to have that that uh, untiring seva onto lotus feet of guru vishnu bhagwan that is actual you can understand the actual meaning of vedant just by leaving the bhagwat bhakt if you are actually taking uh, the politician as guru that is not at all good you can just take this news that there is one politician there and immediately he has just came in this bhagwat seva <laughs> he was a politician definitely inside each and every nerve and each and every blood vessels pol- politician kind of bhav is there so how he can become an acharya he just can take the chair of modi and etc so just by taking the chair of gurudev he will do aparad no but still he has taken that what to do so this is the actual condition now you just need to save yourself prabhupad always used to speak this point that if some kapat vyakti we are actually taking diksha on to that person who is kapat who has so much false ego inside per inside him that so much false ego person we are taking diksha on to his lotus feet that if we are actually taking diksha on to his lotus feet what you will do in that what you will actually get in that you definitely gonna make uh, yourself as a false egoistic person you will yourself makes yourself as a false false egoistic so so just be uh, be very careful beta because this life is of two days just be careful about that what i'm speaking after that definitely you just need to uh, pay for that so this bhagwan ne so this bhagwan prabhupad actually speaking prabhupad speaking that bhagwan has told in gita that bhagwan bhagwan has just given us one offer it is an open offer it's an open offer for us who how he will be doing seva bhagwan he just want to give him the actual value of that just to open your ears and hear that the actual meaning of the shloka what i'm speaking if he not be understanding then he don't need to hear ragvatarma chandrika that is more good 
what he will do by hearing ragavadan chandrika bhagwan actually wants to give him the cost the value what he has paid what he has done seva for bhagwan actually wants to pay for our seva definitely but we are speaking that no we don't need any kind of payment from you you want to give us the payment but this kind of nature is not at all there with me that guru seva i have done already just to, to satisfy bhagwan i don't need i haven't taken even a single penny of guru dev and i haven't taken any rupee one rupee of guru dev why because i have prema for guru dev that's why i have done guru seva i don't need anything from guru dev that's why i have done guru seva and guru dev have also given me this instruction that you beta you see if you need if you need to get bhakti if you need bhagwan then those who people who are doing whatever they are doing they let them do why you are going to pay attention to those foolish people those who are doing in the name of bhajan all rubbish and rascal things so just need to get aside and you just make yourself ready so that you can do bhajan so that kind of topmost hidden treasure you can get in your life in even all the external robbers can't take that treasure even by giving a knife on to your uh, throat they can't take that treasure that is the actual treasure that treasure is actual which is that is bhakti which even the external robbers all those cheater propensitors or those fraudsters can't take that from you that gurudev has just taught me so that's why bhagwan each and every person to do the seva the bhagwan wants to just pay him the value why you have done this so definitely i have give you in return this value you have done this so i am giving you this cost of this value so bhagwan always wants to pay you but in ragavatam chandrika in order to just uh, get deep into the ocean of ragavatam chandrika just uh, the kind of business mood it will not at all uh, uh, be applicable here in ragavatam chandrika while hearing that bhagwan always want to pay you whatever seva you have done for your gurudev but the shuddh devotee pure devotee in bhakti rasamrit sindhu and other granth as well i have just discussed it a lot of time those people in their inside their heart this shloka what i am speaking that in applied form you can find that in their life then only they are eligible to hear ragavatam chandrika they can only hear otherwise other can't are not at all eligible to hear this uh, ragavatam chandrika at all but but just uh, about brajwasi seva bhagwan actually just uh, 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 flying up his hands in the air he is actually speaking bhagwan speaking whether he is nand maharaj or whether he is yashoda maiya shridhar sudam vasudham shridham ratak patak whatever seva you can see bhagwan actually speaking that i am actually just raising my hands up i am i can't do anything in that my i am myself is not under my control this is your actual mahima you get satisfied by your own uh, glorification by your own mahima by your own glorification you are getting satisfied we don't have anything to just pay you what is actually there to pay you whatever we want to give you that is that will actually become a very disrespect for brajwasis i don't want to disrespect brajwasis at all i don't want to disrespect any brajwasis at all in brahmad bhagavata amrit while i was discussing that there at, at at one time one year before i have told this point to in front of you there krishna actually has just told all kind of behavior and ego he has just uh, all has given on to the lotus feet of brajwasis but uh, even krishna knows that this kind of treasure brajwasis don't need any kind of treasure or any kind of name fame opulence they don't need at all i am the only property in their life that's it for brajwasis i am the i am the topmost property in the life of the brajwasis and they don't need any kind of property at all whatever property name fame position gold silver that jewelry nothing they want at all but if you want to give them then it will be insulting for them to give them bhagwan actually can understand that if i will be giving all these things to them then definitely it will insulting or disrespecting them 100% but all these be- behavioral objects what bhagwan has just told us we definitely bhagwan has uh, sent it for some purpose so that we can understand 
that we have bhagwan has given us the consciousness so that we can get the consciousness towards bhagwan all the time that that is that in the life of brajwasis all the time consciousness of bhagwan can be there they it is unbreakable unstoppable there in the night time whether in the uh, whether in the dream also they are actually all the time in connection with bhagwan that's why bhagwan is actually all the time uh, all the time at the lotus feet of brajwasis and he is actually just paying respect on to the lotus feet of brajwasis and he is krishna speaking that uh, whatever seva you are doing so that uh, brajwas is speaking that whatever you are uh, doing we just want to satisfy you especially about the braj gopikas i want to speak that about radha rani and braj gopikas bhagwan shri krishna actually already told that ragvatam chandrika just by hearing this just you open your ears and hear only you can hear this it can it can become successful for you This is the actual Gopika, Bhagwan Shri Krishna speaking to Gopikas that that I can't even pay you. I can't even pay. I am actually just becoming uh, one servant for you for infinity period because whatever kind of seva I have you have done for me. that in order to just get ca- that all kind of rules and regulations of this material world you have just break that for me and all the rules and regulations of this material world you have just sacrifice that just to just for me just to satisfy me just for my satisfaction you have done all this you haven't uh, think of your own interest that you can get the disrespect from this material world you are not at all um, uh, having this kind of mood so this kind of seva you have done for me and uh, i don't have this kind of uh, capability and capacity to just pay you for that in in return it is not at all possible for me to pay you back in return so this kind of seva what you have done that kind of glorification regarding you that now you are yourself your highness your highness that kind of mahanubhavata that is yours only i don't have any kind of highness <clears throat> i don't kind have any kind of lowness as well i don't have any kind of highness and lowness so that's why i'm a very ordinary person and bhagwan speaking that you can satisfy by your highness only you just get satisfied by your highness i have nothing to give to you hamara bas i don't have anything to give it to you i to brajwasis if i'll be actually paying them it is actually insulting to me i will be doing aparad so that's why guru vaishnav they don't want to have this kind of vichar to just pay bhagwan or bhagwan always not at all paying to guru vaishnav as well i'll be discussing it tomorrow that in the south india uh, up till now in south india this kind of misconception is going on in their mind their vichar is actually totally opposite they are actually thinking that maharaj this kind of seva it is not at all possible to do Oh, oh so bad seva it is oh this seva who will do that who this they are actually just speaking like foul words to them they even not at all know about this raganuga bhakti rupanuga bhakti at all they don't understand at all this point they are according to their vichar that narayan is okay they are this is actually good narayan is okay maharaj by from narayan only krishna has come so and bhagwan is come from narayan only narayan has come uh, krishna has come from narayan only this which are they are having this all that this that krishna is actually just taking birth narayan is actually haven't taken any birth so krishna has taken birth narayan is actually just uh, getting all the uh, feeding from mother this that but narayan is actually birthless so this is actually misconception total misconception lakshmi narayan ram sita this is okay this conception is okay this is actually authentic but krishna oh ho oh, this is not at all authentic what actually they, it can be done not at all possible at all this kind of misconception they have so this kind of vichar up till what point they have just told raupad actually with full uh, pain inside his heart actually speaking with full uh, suffering inside his heart he is actually speaking and he is having very with a pain heart they are speak he proper speaking that that uh, 
those south indian people they are actually hypnotized by opulences they are inside their mind they are having this kind of thing that infinity brahmand malik that is narayan and even the master of that is krishna they can't understand this point and the actual procedure the actual procedure in order to just uh, how to do seva of krishna if they are it is not at all actually going inside them. oh you can do seva like this not at all possible Hup. seva is actually just doing dhoop ghee all everything like archan they can do externally they, that is actually good no that that should be the actual reason <laughs> so this vichar is there so their vichar is like that what to do so whatever is their will they can do what to do but by giving sarvang and swarth sarvarth everything you have just uh, surrendered onto the lotus feet of krishna that is already inside the heart of uh, brajvasi is only even their own respect also they have sacrificed that for the satisfaction of krishna this is the actual uh, uh, actual point of respect you can understand this is the actual point of respect even they have just uh, given sacrifice their own respect uh, for the satisfaction of krishna seva that is actually krishna seva that that is the actual treasure of gaudiya bhajan in depth bhajan they can just hear ragvatam chandrika and they can just be dancing in anand so others what they will hear what they will hear by uh, thinking by hearing this kind of ragvatam chandrika they will become sahajya that's it there is no use of hearing this there is no use of hearing ragvatam chandrika like that so there is some eligibility criteria you just need to follow so whatever is the case ragvatam chandrika this this is the actual introduction what i am speaking in this after after understanding this point that ragvatam chandrika you can just get into the ocean, kingdom of ragvatam chandrika after that you can get the opportunity to get into that in the bonded condition in uh, not even in bonded condition the bonded jiva cannot get entry into in ragvatam chandrika at all the actual treasure he cannot uh, understand that and it is not at all useful to show him firstly he just need to get into the vidhi mark and he just need to discuss that and after that maybe sometimes uh, in his lifetime maybe inside his heart he can understand this point and just like unstable like mad person all ev- everything he will be just getting rid of and just to sacrifice for the actual satisfaction of bhagwan that in order to preach the actual gorboni i can come down to any level if i have to come to any condition i will come on to that platform but this kind of vichar that is we just need to follow under the guidance of radha dasya that radha dasya that is the actual glorification of radha dasya in the life of prabhupad we have already seen shila bhaktino thakur in the life of shila bhaktino thakur this is already shown that is called radha dasya the mystery of radha dasya that is the actual what is the actual magic of radha dasya what is the actual secrecy of radha dasya what is the actual topmost thing of radha dasya is in order to understand that even millions and millions of birth you just need to wait and just understand this point even for millions of birth are gone still you can't understand this point so you can't understand this point like that shila vishwana chakravarti pad just by be glorifying his lotus feet that is the that is the he is such a topmost mahapurush he is such a topmost gaur parshad that we for ourselves just for bonded jeevas in a very nice and very handy uh, way he has written lot of books has just uh, given us a lot of treasure in the form of books like in, in the previous purushottam rad i was discussing madhurya kandamani etc i have already just told there and from the previous kartik i was discussing uh, about bhakti shri bhakti what is actually actual bhakti about actual shuddha bhakti i have already discussed it in the previous kartik and this mahapurush is a topmost mahapurush on to whom 
Bhagwan as he has got the topmost kripa of Bhagwan he has already there on him that is actually Vishila Vishnu Chakravarti Pad that topmost kripa he has got from Bhagwan he has got the topmost kripa has uh, he has got from Bhagwan how it is possible that uh, the actual deep uh, meaning of the shastra how actually is getting inside the heart it is getting manifesting in the heart of him of vishnu chakravarti pad it is very much uh, uh, it is it is very much difficult to understand very surprising to see this thing previously what was the name his name was harivallab vishnu chakravarti pad previous name was harivallab and uh, the actual thing is that that shila vishnu chakravarti pad that so much glorification just by seeing that all the devotees they have just joined all together and he has given them the title chakravarti vishwanath chakravarti he is the vishwanasthasya chakravarti that chakra haste the gurudev always used to speak chakra haste kashi it's not kashi vishwanath he vishwanath is actually bhagwan vishwanathasya that that uh, with the chakra of vishwanath in his heart that who is actually cutting the darkness of uh, uh un, who is a uh, darkness of uh, uh, material knowledge who has just come in the form of in our life so that he can just break the darkness of material world that is called vishwanath chakravarti that is the actual meaning of the name of vishwanath chakravarti so this is the actual vichar vishuna chakravarti pad actually it is just saying there that she after going with jeev goswami pad disappearance shila vishuna chakravarti pad has so much glorification that that when in jaipur jaipur mein when in jaipur and there is one king of jaipur actually is becoming surprised how to get the actual uh, samadhan of this thing how to get the actual because the other sampradays there are all four sampradays that our gaudiya sampraday that it is not at all uh, that our gaudiya sampraday is not at all authentic other sampradays were thinking that definitely in their in this sampraday of gaudiya mat gaudiya sampraday they don't have any vedant bhashya at all at that in the, those days that bhashya is very much in necess- is the necessity that vedant bhashya if it is not there then that authentic authenticity you cannot uh, agree on that you cannot understand their authenticity of sampraday of that particular sampraday that's why they are actually very much difficult and uh, govind ji is the actual puja of govind ji they always used to godia godia people always used to do but other sampraday people are actually just uh, uh rup ko swami pad has just uh, appeared uh, uh, govind ji and shrina ji has just uh, appeared by the help of madhvendra puri pad but they are thinking that godia mat don't have any kind of adhikar to serve govind ji and after that the king of jaipur actually asking all the from the godia sampaj all the sadhus that you can just come here and can give the actual solution so who can go there shila vishuna chakravarti pad at that time has just become so much old at that time he was actually over 90 so much old he is and at this age also he in order to just go to jaipur and just you know to go to give the actual uh, uh, actual solution of that that's why in place of that shila vishuna chakravarti pad has just uh, put uh, shri baldev vidya bhushan ji has just gone uh, uh, there that you have already just heard about the actual about the vichar of shuddha bhakti and shrimad bhagavatam commentary and now you can just uh, can establish shuddha vedantic vichar in front of that so that you can just save our gorya sampraday you just need to save the gorya sampraday he has just given the actual uh, ashirwad to vishwana chakra to of balde vidyabhushan vishwana chakra vipad has to go there in jaipur to towards the king of jaipur he just vishwana chakravarti pad has to go to jaipur but he can't go there because his age is so much he is too old so that's why he can't go that's why shri balde vidyabhushan uh, his disciple has just gone there in uh, place of uh, uh, vishwana chakravarti pad and shri balde vidyabhushan has just got the success and nobody has this kind of um, 
uh, effort that they can put on which will they be doing that they can just take the jab, uh, uh, seva of Govind Dev Ji from the hands of Gaudiya Vaishnav. So Govind Bhashya what is actually written that in this whole world you can't even get that kind of commentary what Govind Bhashya has given. That is the topmost uh, Govind Bhashya about Vishuna Chakravarti Pad there is lot of things regarding him. Lot of achievements and glorification that Sri Krishna Kaviraj Goswami when he who has written Sri Chaitanya Chiritamrit in that that Kam Dev Mantra that the actual glorification of Kam Gayatri in that it is written that uh, Kam Gayatri the actual glorification of Kam Gayatri means that Aprakrit Kam Dev Bhagwan Sri Krishna that Aprakrit Kam Dev Bhagwan that each and every uh, limb and uh, body uh, organ of uh, Aprakrit Bhagavan Shri Krishna about 24 and a half syllables that 24 and a half syllable of Bhagavan there are different different kind of Aprakrit organs it is actually mentioned there in details but Vishwana Chakravadva can't understand this point why because in this because in this this kind of vichar is not at all settled that 24 and a half syllable how it is possible okay 24 can be possible but how 24 and a half if uh, in sanskrit there is actually rules that in the in the sanskrit language there is actually rules that anusar visar you just need to uh, just need to reconcile with the chand you just need to uh, reconcile with the sound of chand you don't need to actually combine it with chand that Anusarg, Visarg, all actually you don't need to combine in with the Chand. So after that, that half Akshar, how can it be? How half word, how can it be? How it can be 24 and a half syllable? And after that, when he is not at all understanding this point, Srila Vishuna Chakravarti Pad, Srila Vishuna Chakravarti Pad, he started fasting. He is even not at all taking Prasadam and Anna. And just by quitting and leaving all the unprasadam, after that, when uh, just by taking not taking prasadam, what happened after that? That in between Radha Kund and Sham Kund, he is not at all even uh, drinking water, not even drinking water, and not at all uh, eating prasadam. And he is just uh, all the time thinking that if this kind of vichar of Kam Gaitri is not at all coming inside my heart, then my whole life is actually useless. If this kind of Aprakrit Kam Gaitri Vichar, it is not at all coming inside my heart, then or everything my life is useful, it's meaningless. What I can do, what I can do to just uh, live my life, I just want to just die. I will not be taking prasadam and water. And Radharani come in dream and just speaking to that Hari Vallabh, you just get up. This uh, Krishnas Kaviraj Goswami, that Kasturi Mandri, she is actually Priya Namrasakri of mine. She is my own Priya Namrasakri. She can't speak a lie. She can't do anything incorrect. So you see, one Varmami Kamak, there is one Granth, that half syllable, how actually it is there. It is already there in that Granth. And after that, you can just take Prasadam now, just get up. He has just write it uh, definitely correctly. He is not incorrectly writing that. That Varma, Varmaadi Gamak, there is one book. You can just have this kind of vichar. Now you this you just get up and take prasadam rather than speaking. And after that, that she, that she, Vishwanath, Shila Vishwanath Chakravarti, where, where actually he used to write book at that place, particular place. Shila Vishwanath Chakravarti Pad, where in whatever condition he used to write the book, that even one drop of uh, rain cannot uh, get onto his uh, body at all. How it is possible wherever he is actually writing, lot of rain actually coming but still, that torrential rain is coming but still, Vishwana Chakravati part where actually he is uh, sitting and writing, even one drop of water is not at all falling at us. So it actually is very amazing and surprising thing to hear. It is very much uh, surprising vishay to hear about. Raghavatam Chandrika, this book, that all those Sahajiyas, they don't have any kind of adhikar in that. But uh, their, their bazaar is actually going on. Their will will be going on. 
that radha kund here where wherever you will go all sahajis are there they are actually all uh, maintaining their own kingdom so everywhere actually sahajis are there what to do each and every place they actually are thinking these people are thinking these people are thinking that uh, this is our property they are thinking that uh, goswami's book and all in this they don't have any godia mat don't have any kind of eligibility this is only we are eligible to get that we have only adhikar to get that top most thing <laughs> but but if you are actually having the actual vichar that those sahajiyas those who are prakrit sahajiyas they are this kind of book they don't have any kind of qualification or eligibility to read this book of goswami goms goswami gans they don't have any kind of adhikar only the adhikar have the topmost guru varg what we are having that of godiamat they they are having actual adhikar to read the these kind of goswami's book in raganuga bhakti for each and every person no one get that eligibility to get into raganuga bhajan no one everyone will not will be eligible but what to do like this everything is going on nowadays like that only what to do in that what to do in this we can't do anything in that the actual raganuga bhajan the what is actual uh, hidden uh, secrecy regarding that that raganuga the actual uh, what is the actual uh, uh, mystery behind that raganuga bhajan raga means that uh, those who are actually uh, what do you what do you mean by raga a lot of people are actually questioning when you are actually uh, getting uh, surrendered on to the preeti if you are uh, getting controlled by preeti and you are getting uh, uh, controlled by the anand you are actually getting controlled by anand some seva you are actually doing that is actually uh, actual raganuga bhakti that we are getting the actual preeti all those jeevas they are actually just busy in their own uh, kriya karma or in their own duties by the actual uh, preeti for they are feeling for this material world ranjakata ranjakata jaise like there is one sadak you have just uh, taken you the one cloth you have taken from the market and you just want to make it yellow so what to do in that you just need to that there you have to go to the ranjak who is actually making uh, that uh, uh, he knows the actual color matching how which color you want wear and you have to go to the ranjik in order to get that cloth done into the yellow color so that's the procedure that's the process that inside our heart that kind of there is a special place inside our heart in that what is there that for for no object that particular object there is attraction for that and he is actually getting that special color in that there is actually all uh, hindi song is there ramadan chunariya so this uh, this uh, point actually it's not a uh, enjoyable thing what i'm speaking this holy the people are actually thinking that one male and female they are actually playing some color festival with someone they actually want to color them it is not like that it is all actually foolish concept they are the all these foolish people they are thinking uh, holy like this they don't have this kind of concept they are thinking that male and female they are actually just fighting with the event they will be just uh, immediately uh, 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 be applying some color or gulal on their face but they don't know actually that what is the actual that they can externally can make their heart externally they can color their heart externally you can see that that our heart we are actually coloring it with different different colors of material things but actual uh, color we are taking very nice food and we are actually coloring our heart we have actually like we like to we like to eat dhokla so much desire you have to just uh, eat that you just want to color your heart and just by seeing that one girl oh i am just uh, remembering that particular girl only it means that you are coloring your heart with different different material things you are actually color coloring your heart with maya devi so but what is the actual color that is actually with gopikas only that they have this adhikar that they can have that kind of holy festival with bhagwan holy with bhagwan because inside 
if our internal heart that particular uh, place what is there inside the heart it is a very in depth uh, which are that if our heart that we are actually coloring it with actual color a prakrit transcendental color with sham color then our whole life is spoiled destroyed at all completely goswami jan has given a lot of things in front of us has put a lot of things in front of us and they have just given us the practical proof that if you want to just uh, not 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 at all coloring your internal heart with sham color then goswami jan is speaking that all our uh, life is getting destroyed different different shlokas they have just uh, different different shlokas etc lot of shlokas they have written that prabodhan saraswati pad especially he is actually discussing in front of us this point lot of points uh, slowly steadily i'll be discussing this point uh, uh, day by day very actually surprising the rag bhakti who is getting that kind of eligibility or adhikar for rag bhakti for each and every one nobody uh, for each and every one rag bhakti is not at all there but they are thinking that uh, they can do anything whatever they want you can become gopi and i will also become gopi and in between both will be fighting for that they were they are actually just coloring themselves with maya devi that if you are not at all coloring yourself with sham color you just need to color yourself with sham color uh, only then only you will be getting ahead in your bhakti life bhakt bhajan life parupad always used to speak that sadhan and siddhi in that that in order to get vivarth bhav jeev become prakrit sahajya in that that's why in order to just uh, briefly describe this point lot of time is required in order to just uh, reveal in this point in front of you what propad speaking lot of time is required just hear this point carefully by opening your ear what propad speaking that sadhan and siddhi that in the bhumika of sadhan and siddhi that if some vivarth is coming then prakrit uh, jeev is becoming prakrit sahajya it means he is becoming material sahajya it means that in the bhumika in this context you can uh, just uh, remember one point that in one person in radha kund he has just uh, that uh, what kind of group he has he has just taken in front of propad and is asking in speaking that you are actually sahajya you are sahajya why you are speaking uh, ourselves as sahajya you are sahajya yourself propad actually is smiling and speaking yes you are right that i am sahajya we are sahajyas but we are actually we are aprakrit sahajyas we are actually uh, uh, manifested in the aprakrit sahaj dharma and you are all material uh, material sahaj dharma you are manifesting yourself but you are not at, you are established in material uh, uh, material uh, sahajya dharma and we are actually established in transcendental aprakrit sahajya dharma so what is the actual in depth which are here the in depth which are is that when you are in the sadhan when your sadhan is not at all fixed it is not at all permanent your permanent sadhan is still not permanent but still you are doing sadhan just by doing sadhan slowly steadily you are becoming siddh you are coming at that siddh platform you are become a big platform becoming a milk baba i am just taking fruit baba dhuni baba moni baba so much baba category is there so is becoming a big baba like that by doing sadhan you see and uh, he is just destroying his life in in bonded condition his condition is bonded and now he is in con- bonded condition and he is thinking himself that he is a big baba because this world is like this only maharaj what to do this whole material world is just like this transform themselves as they that even one bonded jiva that all they are speaking all bonded jiva speaking maharaj ki jai they are speaking they are be speaking like 1000 times this point then they are actually understanding that okay yes they are, he is a big version of lot of lot of incident lot of cases are there i can give you solution like examples he is actually characterless but still all people is kapat but all his followers speaking that maharaj ji ki jai ho you know maharaj ji who you know who is maharaj who you know who is this maharaj huh? you know that no you don't know <laughs> foolish so this is the actual world what to do for each and every jiva in front of uh, speaking in front of him like fire that maharaj you are the topmost and 
and uh, he is actually speaking 1001 times and he is speaking 1 lakh times he is actually thinking that yes definitely i am a big personality he is thinking like that because thousands and lakhs of people are speaking if each and every person is speaking that maharaj ji ki jai ho he is thinking that definitely yes i am a big sadhu now ha huh? i am very big sadhu he is thinking but he is so foolish but those who are actually vastav guru that vastav that who is a vast vastav guru he is not at all actually uh, um, if some disciple is going on a wrong pathway definitely he will be just putting his uh, hairs and just be just uh, 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 we will be slapping him with the chappal why foolish number 1 you are doing wrong things do that guru that guru who is actually just uh, not at all of uh, uh, not at all uh, uh, that guru who is not at all uh, protecting us uh, from the from our fall down from our uh, when our consciousness is fall down that guru is actually kapat guru he is actually a top most enemy that gurudev who just wants to don't have he is not at all protecting me that gurudev has not at all protected me but that he, that he has just misused my energy that gurudev is already in bonded condition and we, but he is in a very big position that he has actually all money energy everything he has just exploited them their energy and after that they can understand then my gurudev is actually is the number one cheater that is not at all original he is fraudster so what they have done they have just kicked his gurudev and they have just uh, uh, take uh, just uh, thrown his sanyas and just uh, married and uh, this gurudev has not at all protected me so who gurudev will protect me that i am sharnagat that gurudev uh, will not protect me how it is possible that either i am myself is kapat or my gurudev has some kind of fault or gurudev has some fault and gurudev don't have the capacity to just save me so this can be uh, be the case which is possible so this sadhan ek sadguru only one sadguru only one sadguru in each and every uh, uh, each and every kriya gram of uh, duty of uh, disciple he is actually seeing that hey what you are doing now huh? each and every uh, uh, action he is seeing and the sahajya guru what you can see or a maharaj what to do okay let him do what he wants to do so lot of uh, market uh, sadhus are there that they are actually just taking the international sadhu they have just make their popularity like the like international sadhu and they have shown that you see maharaj already shown to me i will not be just speaking his name because i don't want to just disrespect anyone he is actually just taking the title of international sadhu and uh, he in the internet he is just showing that uh, show, you see this sadhu is actually is just sitting and there you know the chamcha chamcha is uh, just a dirty word but still i am just speaking because bhakti no thakur actually speaking this point what he is actually doing he is actually glorifying his gurudev he is just a chamcha and gurudev actually is just uh, making is feeling happy gurudev is feeling happy <laughs> so he is actually international sadhu he is getting title of international sadhu no hari katha is there i have already just heard nothing is there rubbish foolish no nothing is there valueless costless so those followers that he is my gurudev our gurudev is like that our gurudev is like is so much internationally is that is top most mahapurush you just give me the proof you are not at all oh beta you just give me the actual proof regarding the, just by uh, shouting loud you can't get the give the actual proof you just need to actually prove that practically you can you prove that international sadhu foolish if he is so much followers he is actually following and respecting him. our gurudev is like this like this so gurudev actually feeling anand gurudev actually just by hearing and getting happiness in that feeling anand in that are so this is the actual condition what to do the top most tragedy that what is what is the actual tragedy you know the top most tragedy in life what is that that the or in front of all the bonded jiva when you are speaking jay gurudev jay gurudev just by speaking that he is thinking that he is actually become gurudev that he is become a sadguru he is thinking and they are all bonded jiva they are speaking you just need to um, uh, slap them but still 
he is thinking that he is gurudev so prabhupad actually is speaking here that uh, neither ramanacharya neither madhvacharya neither nimbarka swami or neither vishnu swami ramanujacharya no one has uh, up till now has this kind of uh, deep secret which are has not put in front of us jeev goswami pad has told us so much topmost in depth siddhant he is a tatvavid acharya but still prabhupad that each and every page each and every page of our heart that inside our heart that dirty thing each and every page he has just uh, thrown it and just uh, nobody has just give this kind of analysis what prabhupad has just uh, told in front of us it looks like that inside our heart that there is a dirtiness inside a secret dirtiness prabhupad actually is just speaking that you see so much dirtiness is there inside her prabhupad already shown us that jeev goswami pad hasn't shown us jeev goswami pad hasn't shown that sanatan goswami pad hasn't shown no goswami has shown only prabhupad has shown that di bhakti siddhant saraswati goswami thakur prabhupad that there are a lot of prabhupad in this market nowadays so what to do so di prabhupad i'm speaking di prabhupad has just shown inside our heart that so much dirtiness is there he just has just thrown it away from our heart and just shown us that up till this point so much kaam durga durgan dushit that so much dirty kama is there you just see what is there inside your heart you see you see inside your heart what is there Uh, you you just can see that that is what is expressed by prabhupad you can just open your eyes and just see that is actually prabhupad that is the actual role of gurudev na what do you, what is the actual role of gurudev just to uh, hide the absolute truth no the actual thing role of gurudev is just to open the absolute truth in front of us he is actually speaking lie don't go there just come here that is the actual role of gurudev gurudev is the actual ocean of mercy gurudev can't uh, express any kind of uh, disrespect but in kalikal every gurudev is just putting us in cheating propensity lot of people have just gone into hell when they understood that they are that my gurudev that on 12 to 10 to 12 years are all destroyed we haven't got anything in our life he always used to speak this point also in front of me that all the foreign devotees are coming and speaking that we are not getting energy in our bhajan all actually empty phaka they are not at all getting any energy to do bhajan what to do sirf phaka only all uh, that uh, empty thunderness you know the uh, thunderbolt actually just empty voice is coming that's it you have heard that that uh, empty thunderbolt like the case that on 15th august on 15th august and kya what in new delhi what is actually happening there that some kind of voice is coming there that is all kuch kava that all the military people they are giving the gun salute in the in the in the sky they are doing dum 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 like this voice is coming three times they are doing the gun salute this is also one kind of uh, respect very different kind of respect but this is three times from their gun that kind of empty voice that is called gun salute empty voice is coming just to giving giving respect to president and prime minister big big uh, all ministers are coming they are actually just putting gun salute to them so when the disciple when disciple can understand that then the disciple speaking that you just stay here gurudev i am going away now <laughs> so what to do he is not at all getting anything in bhajan anand will be coming no only then he will be just puri kachodi halwa ha puri kachodi halwa they are jalebi they actually just by taking up till what point that uh, the disciple will be there that he will become lampat no puri kachodi jalebi rasmalai all kheer you just give him mobile and 50000 mobile you give him and that's it he will be doing that only maybe today or tomorrow you can understand this point no that if you are in order to just save someone it is very much difficult just by giving mobile just by giving money just by giving position name fame for how much time we will protect him he is not at all getting the actual thing no 
he will not be getting the actual thing that's why that this kind of we should have this kind of vichar on this point that in sadhan and siddhi in that bhumika when that kind of vivart vivart you know the i will give you one example regarding this now you can understand what is actually vivart vivart you are speaking just understand what is actually vivart you have actually actually seen vivart in navadweep when you will be going to the boat after you are going to the boat after that you can see that there are different different kind of places where there is that water is actually just moving in a circle and is going down that is called vivart that is the actual vivart of water it is very dangerous that kind of uh, cyclonic thing in the water i have already seen that that in that vivart if it someone is going then his life will get he will be dead just water is just going like a wheel and everything is going down in that like the case i want to speak about that uh, that it, there is one international spot that bermuda triangle there is one place that is called bermuda triangle on our earth there is one place if you are actually getting over that ocean then all the time the water is actually moving in a circular circular plane and if the plane is going then automatically the plane will go inside the circular water that is bermuda triangle that if some plane actually is going or some or some uh, anything ship is going then in that particular area that at automatically everything will get destroyed in that automatically everything will go inside that so vivart is so dangerous that you can't even imagine vivart means intuition vivart that is a current that so much actually vivart is so much uh, make the even a normal person can get mad vivart but this kind of vivart that transcendental prem vivart that is totally opposite this the the, the brajwasis who have having this kind of prem vivart that is totally different so that's why prabhupada actually speaking in i to maybe i tomorrow i will be just discussing this point i will be discussing it today very uh, very less this point prabhupada ji actually speaking prabhupada ji actually writing this point that in the sadhan bhumika he is there and he is actually doing sadhan and if he hasn't got the actual permanent avastha condition of the sadhan and he is thinking in this condition that he is actually siddha then he is actually speaking very log log uh, think who is not at all doing one lakh hari naam he is not at i will not be giving one lakh uh, hari naam even to the vaishya to the prostitute also why you are actually giving hari naam to prostitute huh. for each and every person knows that first he was used to speak like that you do you are actually doing yourself one lakh hari naam or not you tell us this point you are actually doing one lakh hari naam that you are giving hari naam to others you are actually always busy in matter so where actually you will be doing one lakh hari naam who will not be doing one lakh hari naam i will not be giving hari naam so big thing he is speaking he, and after that what happen he also has given uh, uh, that uh, mantra to the prostitute he has become so much dayalu so much merciful ha huh? even to the prostitute he is giving mantra that is the actual condition of this material world in this condition to do hari bhajan it is next to impossible i have already speaking the actual thing in this situation whatever the situation is going on in this to do hari bhajan is it's one kind of it's one kind of dream or dream and it is not dream it is next to dream how you can do bhajan all uh, d- opposite way they are going and they, everyone is going in that opposite direction only nobody actually wants to hear anything nobody wants to hear anything nobody wants to hear the actual truth no even one single person don't want to uh, hear that maharaj you just uh, kill me whatever you do but i want to understand that absolute truth only not even a single person is there who can hear that absolute truth absolute way so sadhan and siddhi so sadhan and siddhi the sadhak in the sadhak state the the sadhak state is not one the same one and the same when narad ji maharaj this story i am actually telling you i'll be discussing it tomorrow the i have this kind of desire to discuss this 
नारद जी महाराज एक्चुअली इन हिज प्रीवियस लाइफ नारद जी महाराज इन हिज प्रीवियस लाइफ इन हिज प्रीवियस लाइफ ही एज ही इज एक्चुअली साधन सिद्ध नारद ही इज नित्य सिद्ध इज नॉट नॉट नित्य सिद्ध इज साधन सिद्ध नारद बिकॉज यू कैन हैव क्रिएट मिसकनसेप्शन इन योर माइंड दिस नारद जी एक्चुअली इन हिज प्रीवियस बर्थ एक्चुअली स्पीकिंग अबाउट हिज स्टोरी टू व्यास देव in this uh, in this uh, chatur four months while in the chaturmasya all the sadhu guru vaishnav they came to the house of narad ji maharaj and for full four months they have stayed there they have just uh, done hari katha kirtan mahaprasadam and the boy has just taken mahaprasadam of the achist of all the sadhu guru vaishnav and he has got the remnants of the sadhu guru vaishnav also heard the hari katha kirtan also and after that his heart just got transformed and the mother is only the, his her, his protection and mother, mother is just gone just by the just by the bite of a snake and after that this small boy actually going into the jungle and uh, so all everything after just getting out of the jungle he is actually very feeling thirsty and he has just gone on to one bank of a lagoon of a river yeah, it's not it's not lagoon lagoon actually is coming from ocean it's not lagoon i will not speak lagoon it is just one kind of a pond he just uh, went there and when he has just uh, came to that pond there actually he is feeling very thirsty he is taking bath there and taking some water after just uh, in order to remove his thirst and he don't want to eat because no eating uh, for, for nothing is there to eat and he just uh, sit in one uh, in front of uh, under the tree and he is thinking about what all pure guru vaishnav has just told that hari katha to me after just uh, remembering that just his eyes are just started to uh, uh, hazy a bit he is not at all sleeping it's that half sleeping position and in this situation bhagwan immediately came and just given darshan and after then fraction of second bhagwan just uh, uh, go, gone away from there just even a uh, fraction of a second for bhagwan has just came for it uh, on to in inside his heart to give him darshan and after that just went away and narad ji started seeing again and when that bhagwan has given darshan that he should must have given me the actual darshan fully why and just by started crying narad ji started crying and speaking to him that some aerial voice came from the sky and from the sky one voice aerial voice came and what what is actually speaking there what actually the aerial voices come that you boy you see that those your you don't have that kind of don't kind of that kind of maturity in you for them to give them darshan is not at all possible this point i will be discussing it tomorrow today i have and ragvatan muchandrika it's a very surprising and very top most amazing book and this is the actual glorification of this book i will be discussing it tomorrow on this point today i'll be just uh, giving rest up till this point premaan jano charita bhakti bilochanena santah sadaiva hridayeshu bilokayanti jang sham sundaram chinta guna sarupam gobindamadi purusham tamaham bhajami वांछागलपतरोसे के बासिंद भविष्य पतितानंग पावन भो वैष्णव्यो नमो नमः